Welcome back. I hope you guys are having a wonderful morning. It's been a while. I did live streaming at home. So this is my, if you're brand new to the channel, welcome to daily live streaming. Daily live streaming. I'm trying to go live every single morning, trying to share with you kind of like tips and tricks. And most times we, you know, we, we just hang out. That's it. Okay. If you are looking for, goodness, uh, in-depth product review or if you know you want to learn something about coffee you might want to change your channel okay so this is not it i mean so this channel is about uh bring the community in having some fun you know a few minutes every single morning and we just make some coffee we just hang out okay if you have any questions or comment i'm looking at the live chat going on right now so i'm gonna shout out to leopold from luxembourg so he's on, let's say, I see Linda's on as well. So we just hang out. Uh, sometimes I'll do like product demo. Uh, because, I mean, most of you watching this channel, which means you guys are going to watch, you know, other professional channels out there. So, I mean, they do a much better job. Comes down to product review. But, okay, here's big but though. If you guys are looking for live, okay, live product demos, because sometimes I want to see it. Okay? I want to see the actual life, what they feel like using that particular gadget or grinder or coffee machine. You get to see firsthand. I mean, most times uh, edited videos, we cut out. Okay, some of you saw my old, older edited videos. I cut out a lot of bad stuff, okay? A lot of, you know, imperfect shot, imperfect, imperfection, okay? Shots or something I don't like about the particular, the frame, I just edited it out. But at least live streaming, you get to see the good and the bad of particular products I'm gonna showcase. So this morning's topic is, are you in the coffee rabbit hole, okay? I mean, I know some of you out there, especially in our live chat, I know Justin and Linda, some of you, hold on, who is on this morning? And I see Brent as well. Shout out to Good Brothers Coffee from the Brent. So, I mean, they're in the rabbit hole, okay? They are kind of like in submerged into the coffee hobby, okay, hobbyist. Okay, by the way, if you have like machine like this, Bravo Barista Express or Pro, I mean, you guys are already hobbyist, all right? If you're watching me right now, I think you're not a casual coffee drinker. If you're a casual coffee drinker, you're not gonna watch me. So, I mean, congratulations, folks. You guys are into that coffee rabbit hole. Man, it's not a, sometimes it's not a good place, all right? Okay, for example, if you have, let me show you what I have, all right? Let me show you. If you are into deep into coffee, not only you're gonna have all kinds of gadgets, different tools. Okay, so this is the Bravo tools. St. Anthony Industry. I know Brit is selling the, the puck paper. We have puck paper here. What else I got? I have the, it's called TDS meter. All right, TDS meter. We have a various scale, bottomless porter filter, separate grinder, even organized, you know, coffee tours as well. We have a different types of cups. We have different types of latte mugs. I mean, look at it. Okay, I have tons, all right? So I have, hold on, you know, let's turn on the coffee machine. It's kind of like become, it's more than a, just a hobby, okay? It's becoming a, your lifestyle. Because I know most of us, I mean, most of you out there, you just want to make quick coffee in the morning, go to work, okay? You know, live your life. But sometimes, I mean, like for myself, okay? Uh, since I'm making the coffee beat, I start up with just one machine with one tool. So this is my first ever purchased uh, from Amazon distribution tour. Man, that was great, okay? I remember it was like almost four years ago, okay? Great tours cost me only about 15 bucks. And now, 
goodness, I mean, we are coming a long way. At the time, this is the only tools I can find on Amazon. Okay. Uh, fi uh, what, 15 bucks, 15, 16 bucks? There's no 54 millimeter at the time. Okay. And I was very excited. The Prima come up with bottomless pore filter. $89 okay, at the time. But now you're going to move forward, what, three years later? <coughs> Excuse me. I'm going to put some water. <coughs> okay, if you are wonder, I'm coughing so much lately. I'm still dealing with, I know some of you saw me well, a couple years ago, and I was dealing with the COVID-19. So this is my uh, kind of like side effect. I'm still dealing with this called long COVID, okay? Long COVID. So I never got recovered from it. So anyway, so that's why if you hear me coughing, that's why, okay? I'm not sick. I'm just dealing with some issues. Anyway, so let's go back to this, okay? So uh, three years later, all right? A uh, company like Bravo Temper or Bravo or San Anthony Industry coming up with their own products, okay? The, the made for 54 millimeter, like Bravo Vista Express or Touch. So, I mean, they're amazing products. So here's a between coffee hobbyist and someone in the rabbit hole, okay? If you're in the rabbit hole, those people out there, yeah, they're going to be willing to spend, all right, the half cost of coffee machine into tools, all right? That's kind of like what I mean by if you are really into, you know, coffee, you know, go through the, you know, whole, you know, whole nine yard, right? So not only that, you're going to be playing with like 3D print, uh, WDT tools. What else is out there? We have, uh, it's called, put some water drops on your cup uh, before you grind your coffee beans. Uh, start doing the single dose on your coffee. Instead of using hopper, now you are using the single dose. So, which means you, there's another, you know, they have a single dose modification out. I mean, it's become, you know, you're, Kind of, I don't want to. I don't want to say word obsessed. All right, I don't want to say word obsessed, but start measuring your TDS. All right. Yeah, I mean it is. I mean it is a lot of fun, but just make sure talk to your loved one first. Okay. My wife, she got sick of it, so I mean I have some stuff here, but most of my stuff at my uh, my shop. Okay, my shop in. Uh, I own a small computer shop and then I turn one room into kind of like coffee it's not a studio more like coffee cave okay coffee dungeon or coffee cave yeah just stop everywhere but you know I mean we do make some a lot of videos we do have some fun there all right uh, before we keep talking let's make some coffee first okay I'm just gonna go easy way I'm just gonna use my spouted okay I'm not gonna even bother and then let's make a quick latte there. Yeah, let's, I'm not, maybe like small cappuccino. Oh, you know what, let's not forget the puck screen. Goodness, they got all kinds of tools out, guys. I mean, if you wanna spend money on your 54 millimeter, like your Bravo machine, man, the, the list of options are long, okay? Again, I'm just gonna measure out my 18 grams. So I'm using uh, coffee from Brazil, okay? We got Good Brothers Coffee. I'm using it this morning. I'm just gonna tap it like this. I'm just gonna tap it. Yeah. And I usually do uh, WDT on my oh, bottomless pore filter, but not this time. I'm just gonna go use my old tools here. All right, I'm just gonna quick tamp. Maybe I'll show the, the little workflow. <laughs> <coughs> All right, here we go. 
I'm just going to do a quick workflow. I mean, it looks pretty good. Okay, I mean, the reason why I like to use the puck screen, uh, I'm going to have a clean shower screen and also usually have a dry puck come out. So that's what I like about it. You know what? Hold on. Let's do this. I'm just going to flip the camera for a second. Okay. Here we go. Again, if you ever start measuring your coffee, I, I think you are past that, okay? I think you are become someone in a rabbit hole. I mean, I'm just going to do a manual mode. I don't know how many people actually do a manual mode. I mean, I like to do manual. Hold down. Going into pre-infusion, I like to wait about maybe three seconds and let go. And then let's see, I'm at uh, 13 gram. I like to do like one to two ratio. This is about 22 seconds. I have 45 grams, so I need to change my grinder size for sure. But has to still have lots of crema. All right, at this point, let's steam some milk. I'm just going to put some milk in it. All right, here we go. Uh, comes to spe uh, steaming milk, goodness. There's no shortcut for it. I'm just going to wait until the pump is kicking. I'm going to shut it. I like to go to 9 o'clock, okay? Introduce the air for a little bit in the beginning and submerge it. This this is thermal block, so kind of like or gas. Think of it as like single, okay? So you can only do brew or steam. You cannot do both at the same time. I know dual uh, dual boiler machines out there. You can actually do it, but not this one. Okay. Just to make sure wipe it clean. And I like to flush after. Takes a little bit. Yeah, just make sure I wipe it clean there. All right, folks, how about some little latte art? Okay. I like to top it a few times. The milk texture should be like milk, kind of like wet paint. It's not quite there. Okay, I'm just, this, this is a little flat, but it's, I'm just going to break the crema. The key to good latte are, man, slow. You got to slow down the pull. Here we go. Okay, this is not... This is not what I want to be with. Not quite. But still, it's a little better, but yeah, it's not quite there. It's all about the, the steaming milk, okay? All about the, how to steam the milk. Hold on. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go without any sugar this time. Cheers, guys. Not bad, okay. Very nutty, chocolatey. I mean, I do enjoy that Brazil uh, from Brent. Oh, by the way, so we do have a coupon code, guys. Take advantage of that coupon code. I got 25%. The coupon code. It's been on my channel for last two years or three years. So if you are, if you haven't ordered it, make sure to take advantage of it. Hold on a second. Ian, coffee's ready. So that is coffee for my son, okay. Anyway, so if you have a separate milk jug for your latte, which means also you have become a person in that rabbit hole, okay? But I mean, it is a lot of fun, all right? When it comes to 
comes to you know doing hobby there safe okay you don't have to worry about you know riding a motorcycle or fast cars i mean so this is your hobby okay so since this is your hobby if you have the time okay time is a big thing okay because i know most of you trying to go to work in the morning you may have about five ten minutes to make yourself cough coffee i think this machine can do that okay so bravo express especially pro i mean pro is I'm gonna talk more about next few days, but man, I played with a lot of coffee machine over the years, but this, I feel like the special give you the pro just enough, uh, give you just enough control to have, you know, have some fun with it. So I'm gonna check out the, my live chat here. Let's see. Let's see, I'd like to see what people are talking about this morning. I do have my laptop here hold on a second here you got some few people on this morning uh, we have a uh, ice snapper 10 from ohio okay you got dean is on for first time you, i see jonathan i saw dot rock okay hold on who else is on you got becky's on as well you got richard uh, no caramel this morning, Richard. Okay, got Steve's on. Okay, hold on. Yeah, again, got Dave. Got about 40 people watching right now, so make sure to join the chat, okay? I mean, we do have a great group of a community. We just hang out every single morning making some coffee, so Anyway, uh, let me know in the comment section if you are watching, you know, after live streaming, are you in the coffee rabbit hole? Uh, if, if so, how many time, I mean, how much time are you spend on it? Okay. If you are single, you have plenty of time, sure. But if you are married with the kids like me, I do have, you know, I, I cannot spend too much time at home, okay, making coffee or coffee condom, but I'm glad you guys are here this morning. And I'm going to, I think we're going to do another live streaming later, okay? We're going to have some fun there. I think let's play with, I don't know what we're going to play with. But I do have some really good coffee. And uh, I think, you know what, let's do the coffee of the month. This is uh, beginning of September right now, so I do have coffee of the month. So this, this coffee could be coffee of the year so far, 2022. So I know I did talk about it, but I'm going to talk about it a little more because... Man, something special. This coffee is very, very special. I did, you know, over the years, I did try really, really good coffee. But I have to say, this is a... So, it's up here, okay? I mean, so that one pushed my, the hatch coffee, the Lightsey, was my favorite last year, 2021. But this coffee actually pushed down and the go off the top. So, yeah, so this is good coffee. Uh, let's talk about the sometime later this morning or yeah, more like later this morning. So I'll be back for that. All right, folks. I hope you guys are having a wonderful morning and see you soon.